everyone, it's Coach Damon here. I want to let you know about an amazing opportunity. The Tillman Johnson two-day live lacrosse goalie coaching mini camp. Oh man, I'm so pumped for this event. Tillman is going to teach us his fundamentals, okay? Now, we're going to do this as a fundraiser for the National Multiple Sclerosis Society. So many of you don't know this, but just three years after Tillman's legendary performance in 2003, when he won the national championship, 2006, his sister was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis. So he's seen firsthand the physical and the emotional pain that people fighting this disease have to go through. And raising money and helping people with MS is a cause near and dear to his heart. So proceeds of this live mini camp that we're putting on are going to go directly to the National MS Society. So proceeds are going to go to a great cause. And Tillman is going to open up the hood, lift the hood on his fundamentals. Never been done before. A lot of people don't know this, but in addition to being a legend of the goalie position, Tillman is also an elite coach. So he has coached numerous Division I goalies, goalies who have gone on to play at the highest levels, including Nick Morocco, who played at Georgetown and also just had an amazing season with the Cannons. Tillman's coached goalies that have gone on to play at Harvard, uh, Dartmouth, Boston University, Princeton, just, just to name a few. So he's, in addition to being a great goalie, He's an elite coach, and he's going to, like I said, lift up the hood and teach us his fundamentals. So what exactly are we going to learn? Tillman actually sent me a list. I'm just going to read it, all right? Listen to this. The Tillman Johnson Pyramid of Success. The fundamental technique for each save. One-on-ones, how to make the game, those game-changing saves. Clearing techniques. Big eyes. Tillman's special technique for intense focus, pregame preparation, and how to get in the zone, Tillman's muscle memory drills, communication to lead the defense, and then technical things like pipe-to-pipe -pipe play, playing the ball behind, and rebound control. This is going to be amazing. So we're going to run this as a two-day live event, February 15th and Thursday, February 17th at 7 p.m. Eastern, both days, live event, live goalie coaching with Tillman Johnson. He's going to cover those topics I just mentioned. If you cannot attend live, don't worry. You're going to get access to the recording, lifetime access to the recording, so you can watch it anywhere, anytime that you want. You're also going to get access to Tillman's slides and um, any videos that he uses to demonstrate these techniques or drills. And we're also going to do a uh, Q&A at the end of each session, so you can ask Tillman, those questions that have been on your mind. It's going to be an amazing event. Remember, proceeds go to the National MS Society. For the first time ever, Tillman Johnson doing a live training event. So valuable, such valuable stuff. It's unbelievable. Worth hundreds of dollars if you ask me. But obviously, if you know me, we want to get as many goalies in here as possible. So for just 49 bucks, we're going to get a ticket to this event. And remember, proceeds go to the National MS Society. To get your ticket, you're going to want to go to laxgoalierat.com slash Tillman. T-I-L-L-M-A-N. laxgoalierat.com slash Tillman. If you're watching this on YouTube, there'll be a link right down below. Get your ticket, just 49 bucks, laxgoalierat.com slash Tillman. I don't know about you, but I'm really pumped for this event. I hope to see you there February 15th, 7 p.m. Eastern. Take care. Record numbers coming into the semifinal matchup at M&T Bank Stadium in Baltimore to see the Maryland Terrapins in the second of these semifinal matchups taking on the Virginia Cavaliers. It's the three seed against the two seed, and it promises to be an exciting close game. Tillman Johnson, the most energetic, explosive, and emotional goalie that you will ever see. He has the ability to make a save and change the dynamic of this game. Rotating and look at the extended defense and a man down even for Virginia. A pair of 15s. That's Trey Witte stepping out to Joe Walters. Only a freshman. Big shot early on. The foot save from Tillman Johnson. Well, the first clean look for Maryland against Johnson. And Johnson comes up with a nice save. And Quint as a goalie, that's huge. 
to find your comfort level. The sight lines here are pretty solid for these goalies. The background will make the ball look real white. Maryland taking their time on the offensive end of the field. Mike Mollett right here really will initiate a lot of their offense. Good shot from Walters. Watch that kid, freshman from the Rochester area. He is an incredible shooter, but that's what he does best. He's a pure lefty that can really bring it. That low to low shot, though, gobbled up by Johnson. Right there, Joe, great timing because he just put one off goal and he's got the ball right now. Back side of Waters and Tillman Johnson. Everybody talked about him having to have an acrobatic, explosive day in the net. He's had two nice saves so far. Flurry, five saves already by Tillman Johnson. Maryland has put a lot of pressure on the Cavalier net. Two layups right there. Johnson jumping up and deflecting the ball. Well, Dave kind of won't. Tillman Johnson, one of the stars all year, and he has been tested already. We thought he would flourish in the hot spotlight that is the NCAA semifinals. He's got five saves on five shots. The first two are easy. This is a save that you love to make as a goalie. Just low to low. As long as you get your stick down to the ground, you're in good shape. Joe Beninati, what's it look like from your perspective? Quint, you know goalies are uh, superstitious. Tillman Johnson's used the same stick shaft on his goalie stick since he was eight years old, and he's used it very, very well. Out of St. Mary's in Annapolis, Tillman Johnson. Spotted by Dom Starge at his camp and said he had a little something that other goalies didn't have. He liked the flair of Tillman Johnson. Not always the best winning percentage, save percentage, but he loved what he did on the spectacular. Up. Landing is number 12. And now they 5 1 3. Shot in close and another big setting the middle of the field off. Maryland pushing push to the rack against Bowen, who slips on his line. You know, he's, he's a Dominic Hasek in that he sells out completely with his body. Coming from behind. They vacate the crease. And close, great job. Three folks. And the ball to hunt on the crease. This is a sick save. Look at Johnson's tenacity. In super slow-mo, watch. He'll never give up on the ball. His eyes are on it. Multiple fakes, three, four. He hangs in there as his legs are given out on him. So great move by Maryland. It could be a goal. But again, Tillman Johnson. Parker with his bounce shot. And you'll see the athleticism right there. Getting nice bend in his knees. Reset with the really pass to And now into the middle. And then communication much louder on the field right here. It looks like Maryland. Folks, highlight reel himself, Tillman Johnson, just pulling it out of the air. How easy did Johnson make that save look? And that was a difficult one. He had to bring the stick all the way across his body. Goal a minute is the standard for comebacks. There's plenty of time. Waters with that big left hand. The freshman from Rochester, and Johnson again, makes it look easy. Picks it out of the air. 14th save of the day. Size for him, six foot four, also out of the Landon School. Runs on, runs on. This quarter, shots went 15 to five in favor of QBA. Quite different than that first half. No question. When this one's over, Maryland will look to that first quarter, capitalizing on your opportunities. Larry goes right by Gladding, and then he gets in close with a shot, and Tillman Johnson this time slaps that one, and then Brian Hunt puts a follow-up on him, a little postscript, and he's willing to answer. Q, you get in the zone that almost any shot, no Goal shot set. scares Hunt. you. He is unbelievable. Well, the first shot's Goal easy because it basically just hits you. You just hope it hits you. You don't even have to move. Goal the set. second one's a reaction save, Goal though, Goal. off of the Hunt redirect. They really have played with guts and heart. 12 to 3 the score, lead by 9. In close to LaMonica, and that would be a goal on anybody except for Tillman Johnson today. He has been unbelievable in the goal. 16 saves. 16, only three goals against. From a percentage standpoint, one of the highest percentages you'll see. Lee and Alex, Alex the attackman. For Syracuse, and Lee the defender from Maryland. Joe Parker, 32, had that early goal, first goal of the game for Maryland. Uh, this time his unit's in the ball, walks around to the back side. Tillman Johnson, the story of the game, really, in the first half, it was Tillman Johnson stopping Maryland almost single-handedly. Maryland dominated the first 20 minutes of this ball game. But there were four or five absolute rob saves 
Stand on your head, doing cartwheels in the cage. Tillman Johnson. Another save for Johnson, who remains in the game. Quick outlet, they love to fire it up and get it going. And now Virginia seeing Agliotti. Tillman Johnson again, emotional leader, the kind of guy, Quince, who loves to play to the big crowd, to the big game, seems to get better in this kind of environment. Yeah, and last week he ended off the quarterfinal game on such a run. And watching him warm up yesterday uh, with David Curry, their assistant coach. You know, I was also very, just very impressed by the way he was moving between the pipes. I know he likes this grass field. And then the work that he did today, he got off to a good start. Didn't see him guessing at any shots. And once he gets rhythm and once he gets comfortable, he's a guy who can change the game. And this is when he was separating the, the, the two teams a little scrum that we have behind the cage, but he's only a junior. Nice size for, for a keeper, 6'1", 192, fills it up, and he sees a lateral movement. His career high is 18 saves versus Penn State, 17 now. I don't know if he'll come back onto the field, Quint, with 340 left. Well, if I'm Coach Starge, yeah, I'm, I'm probably gonna take him out, but I'd like to get him an, an ovation. So you probably put him back in, or off a timeout, you know, you sub him on the fly, and that way you, you give the Virginia fans a, a reason to, to cheer him, and, and he'll use that momentum going into Monday's game. Tell Johnson focused, ecstatic. But we'll take this moment to give you our Pontiac winning moment. And Quint, it's gonna be Tillman Johnson with the big time saves. Pick one. He had so many unbelievable moments. 17 saves on the afternoon, but the quality and the emotional impact that those saves early in this game, it was Maryland who came out and they took it to Virginia, but it was Virginia who went into the halftime up five to two. Maryland couldn't have played a better first half. But Tillman so Johnson our Pontiac winning moment was actually the first half for Tillman Johnson because he was unbelievable against the whole team. UCLA playing a tremendous game in Oklahoma City. Underway will be joining that in a moment as we get through one of the most dramatic weekends in lacrosse history. Tillman Johnson, the star of the day. Tremendous job.